we're going to talk about how to read a thermometer. Okay, a thermometer is an instrument that helps us measure temperature. It can give us the temperature in Fahrenheit or it can give us the temperature in Celsius. In different countries, different measures are used. Some countries use Fahrenheit and some countries use Celsius. In the US, we use Fahrenheit. So let's go ahead and find out how to read this. The way the thermometer is set up is at the bottom, you have the lower temperatures. The negative temperatures are the coldest. And as you go up on the thermometer, it gets hotter and hotter. Water freezes at about 32 degrees Fahrenheit or zero degrees Celsius. All right, let's look at this example. Here, if you see the thermometer goes all the way up to what it looks like, 20 degrees Fahrenheit. And then if you look at the Celsius, it's at about, it's between negative five and negative 10 degrees Celsius. So I would say it's at about negative seven or negative eight. So we'll say negative seven degrees Celsius. Let's look at another example. In this example, our thermometer goes up to about 45, because it's right there in the middle of 40 and 50. So we could say that the temperature is 45 degrees Fahrenheit. Now, if we look on the Celsius side, we see that it falls right in the middle of 5 and 10. So here again, we could say that it's about 8 degrees Celsius. I could have put 7, but 8 degrees is just about right. Let's look at another example. Here, my thermometer goes all the way up to about 80 degrees Fahrenheit. Now, this is pretty warm weather. This is the kind of weather that you would find in the spring or in the summertime in the United States. On my Celsius side, it's at about 26 or 27 degrees Celsius. So we'll say 27 degrees Celsius.